So what's going on, everybody? Are you ready to get scared? You, you want to see something really scary? You bet. Yeah, do you want to see something really scary? Well, guess what? The Spirit Halloween finally opened in my area. Yeah, finally. Finally! Yeah, right, finally. So let's get in there. I'll show you a little bit of footage in there. There's one thing that I really want to look for, and if they've got that, I'll be happy. But uh, the store just opened. I know they're just still putting stuff out. So let's get into the store, then come back here, and I'll show you the haul. What are we waiting for? Let's go. It is time, Michael. So this is the first trip. This Spirit Halloween is just opening in the local mall. So let's get in here. Let's go. Yeah, I've already looked around a little bit. They don't have everything out yet, but they do have the, some of their t-shirts. Cool. Lots of art. The clown. That's cool. Clown Cafe. Got some bloody disgusting. Kind of like Walmart had the figures. That's a cool Michael Myers on the TV. They don't have fat guy t-shirt sizes in here, so... That guy in a little coat. I guess I won't be indulging. But a few items from Friday the 13th. Got some Beetlejuice stuff out already. Chucky. I got some Chucky weapons. I got the knife down there, the hammer. That's cool. Got this Halloween outfit that comes with that hard plastic mask. Hey, that's a really cool michael myers banner there i like that hey they might uh i think i bought a bunch of banners and stuff last year for like a dollar <laughs> i'd buy that for a dollar yep so some halloween pins this is the trick-or-treat section nothing major the killer clowns from outer space that bat's kind of cool the puppets. There's the big uh, popcorn gum. Got the masks. Look at that. They got a big slim animatronic there. And look, they got the uh, Art the Clown one here too. I really like that. Uh, my wife wouldn't let me get by with getting that. She loves clowns. Not. Your Nightmare on Elm Street section. Got the mask. That's kind of neat. What is this? Oh, that's cool. I like that. Hocus Pocus. Yeah, I like these little minis they got here. Look, they got Pennywise, Ghostface, Leatherface, and Sam. Those are cute. I like those. Then they got some bobbleheads. Little Jason back there. Got Freddy, Pennywise. And what are these little micro vinyl figures? Charms? Nah, I'm not really interested in that. Little small stuff like that. But this was up near the register. And then they got the Pops. They got the Hocus Pocus. I think most of this stuff was out last year. I know that Killer Clown was. And I know Sam was. So over here in the mask section. A little wide angle shot there. They don't have everything out yet. We got the Halloween 2 mask. There's a brief glimpse of my wife and me in the mirror. Yeah, I was wearing my Michael Myers shirt. Halloween Ends, which I still would defend that movie. I like it a lot. I like it like a lot. And this is some of the stuff I came in here to look for. This light up stuff. I got that last year. That's kind of cool. That's a Michael Myers with the pumpkin, pumpkin lights up. Uh, that's kind of, that's a bust of, obviously, the Crypt Keeper. That's kind of neat. Not really interested in that. I do like this. Must not have the, do they have it turned on? But that's obviously from Mars Attacks. That's pretty neat. But that's not what we're in here for. You'll see in a second. That light up Sam there, we have one of those. They they don't have any of these damn things working. Ghost face light up. Look at that. That works. That's kind of cool. 
When did Ghostface have a pumpkin? Either way. They got uh, Sam there with a street light. But um, Halloween 2. I don't know what the candle holder things. But yeah. Now that somebody's out of the way here. These, this is what I was in here looking for. The Halloween 2 pumpkin. It's a statue. I love that thing. So I got to find out. They got two of them. Which one looks the best? Which one's got the best painting? Just to give it some scale. And then uh, over here, uh, this is actually the other side of the... Where you come in. Look at these uh, animatronics. Bounce in your step. It's just so <laughs> Mind if I follow you around? <laughs> He's loud. What about the scarecrow? Does it move? Little Michael Myers plushie there. Sam plushie. Uh, then they got the Beetlejuice sign, the light up sign. I've got that going down into my basement. That's kind of neat. Some more plush. Somebody knocked a clown head over. It wasn't me. Animals attack. Animals going wild. What are your guys' thoughts of these things? Like the baby. I, I'm not much on these things, man. Like the toddler type things. I just think it looks silly. Then they got some like canvas style paintings of Michael and Lori, Frankenstein, Jason. Look, they got your old buddy Art the Clown there. They didn't have an Art the Clown Terrifier section out yet. I guess I got to come back in here when they finish stocking. This is bonus footage from when I went into the Spencer's. Look at they got these little vinyl figures. Yeah, that spirit. They need. I need to get everything um, laid out in there and put out before I go back in there. So they got a ghost face. That's pretty cool. And then they got Sam there from Trick or Treat. They also had these uh, VHS style clamshells. That are, I didn't see in a Spirit Halloween. They got Annabelle. That's kind of cool. I like that. And then they had Elvira. So this will be like a little mini haul. But let's get out of here. And let's get home. And I'll show you what I actually picked up. Let's go. So what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the Jeffman 316 Pop Culture Reporter Channel. I'm your host as always, Jeffman316. Says Jeffman316 live on that sign in the background. What is that? Sunday nights, 10 p.m. Eastern. Usually we watch along to a movie. Half the time we don't watch the movie. We just have fun talking. Come over and join us. I'm going to be doing another one this coming Sunday when I'm filming this. But I went into Spirit Halloween. I live in a rural area. They usually open the Spirit really late. This footage is over a week old, so the store has been there for a while. Um, the, the, with the time I went in, it was probably three quarters full. They were still putting a lot of stuff out. So I'm going to go in there again. You'll probably get some more footage from me. But the main thing that I was looking for, you obviously know what it is. It's what everybody else was looking for, and I want to be really careful. Because I saw somebody break one of these online. But I got the Halloween 2 pumpkin. That shit is awesome. But that was... Awesome! <laughs> Look at that. That's epic. It's got the Halloween 2 logo on the back. I've taken the try me. Look, you can hear me talk inside the skull. Or the pumpkin. So we'll come back around. Alright, and it lights up. So I've got the try me part off. But look at that. <laughs> see it flickers a little bit like it's a real light so what i'm going to do is i'm going to record some footage of it in the dark so you can see it better and i'll put it here but i love the opening of halloween too when i was younger man it used to spook me out watching that in the dark well the pumpkin opening up and turning into the skull so i was so glad they finally did something with that and marketed it um so i'll show you some footage of that with lit up let's go
So that's cool. So check your app, or your, uh, so I almost said app. See, I don't know that they've got an app, but go to spirithalloween.com. I did it on my mobile device. Hit the little location button to find the stores up at the top. Put your location in your area in, you know, like your zip. When it finds the store, go over to the side and hit it where it says more info. More than likely, there's going to be a 20% off coupon under there when you scroll down. Yeah, keep scrolling and go down and find it. Now, I have went there one time before and there was no coupon, but I think it's supposed to be there most of the time. Um, if not, wait a day or so and then refresh and it'll probably show up. So that was $44.99. So I got it for, what, like nine bucks off. So like basically 36. Now something that size made that well that lights up, I'm fine with paying that. So I went ahead and picked up one other thing because I got my wife to use the coupon as well. Now I'm kind of cheap. I'm a cheap bastard. Um, I don't like to get a lot of things in there at once that cost money because I want to go back in and use a 20% off coupon every time because it's reusable. But the next thing that I got, speaking of light up, is the Halloween 2. And you might not be able to see this well. It's a Halloween 2. It's a 10, I don't know, like lantern type thing that you can put a, a candle in. Now I've got a, a tea light that's not that, that works with a remote. And I'm going to show you what this looks like lit up. Um, this was $18.99, and so I got, what, $1.90 twice. So I basically got, like, um, was it $3.80 off of it? So basically 15 bucks. It's 10 so I think it's worth it. I'll show you that lit up here as well. And then because I didn't want to spend a lot of more money in there, and they had they only had about 75% of the stock out, I'll go back in there later. I got this Michael Myers. It looks like that's from Resurrection. Um, shot glass. It's made out of plastic. It says, have a knife day. But either way, I was 99 cents, so I got that. Um, the other stuff is like usually Halloween 2. As you can see, you know, the back of that pumpkin said Halloween 2. So... Um, Halloween 2, you know, obviously is marketed by Universal Pictures, so that's what's on a lot of the stuff. But um, this thing is fragile, like I said, a lot of people, um, I've seen a lot of people have it. It's the main thing that everybody wanted. So yeah, so hopefully you enjoyed that footage. But I got a little bit of bonus footage I added in there, so my, while my wife was in Bath and, was it Bath and Body Works, um, I went ahead and went down to Spencer's, and they had a little section of Spirit Halloween stuff. Nothing great, but I did find some of these acrylic stands with bases. They're basically acrylic figures like you get in the Zobie Fright Box. So I got three of them. So the first one is Ghost Face. You can see that. It's hard to see. It's acrylic. But it's got a base, so you pop that out, stick it on there, and stand it up like a little three-dimensional figure the second one i got is sam look at that for trick-or-treat and of course i got your boy mikey once again halloween 2 so those were 7.99 each probably pay a little more than that um uh, but that's the main ones i wanted there so this is pretty cool so that's my first trip into spirit halloween Within a week or so, I know they'll have everything in there. Plus, I'll probably have another 20% off coupon. If you went to the site and it didn't have it, keep refreshing. You'll find it. So, yeah, I'm so glad to find the one main item I wanted. And the next trip, hopefully, they'll be stocked up on Terrifier stuff. Because, you know, that movie's right around the corner. So, what did you guys pick up in Spirit Halloween? Put that in the comments down below. Let me know, did you find these items? Would you have bought those? Chat it up in the comments down below. I love you guys doing that. While you're down there, hit the like, comment, subscribe, share. Do all that normal YouTube stuff. You can like it. You can subscribe to the channel down there. You can comment down there. You can also hit the notification bell down there. It'll let you know when I post new videos like that next Spirit Halloween video. Uh, hopefully you're not tired of seeing people's tired-ass Spirit Halloween videos. But hopefully you uh, saw a couple things in here that you know might inspire you to go out to the store. So like I said, keep supporting me. I'll keep making great content. And until next time, boys and girls. This has been Jeff Man 316. I'm your pop culture reporter, and I'm signing out saying you guys be safe out there. Kind of joke. I've been trick or treated to death tonight.
You don't know what death is. 